Okay, here we go. This has got to be it. Security protocol activated. Scan artist security credentials immediately. Uh. Do I have that? Well, well. After all these years, an artist still has something to hide. <laughs> We're definitely onto something now. Driver, anything you find down there, scan and transmit it back to us. We'll work on disengaging the security protocol. Oh my god. Search research lab platforms for scannable lab data. Like this? Arda Phenomena Report. Property okay, of Arda. Here's something. This thing in the deep zone, they called it the well. Oh, fantastic. Tobias, run those reports through the decryptor and see what you can find. That's one. I guess we have to find more computers like that. Might be one over there, too. Let's go, Carl. I like how they're all conveniently placed car driving distance away. Your remnant origin story, if you will. <laughs> Let me guess. You're about to ruin a good urban legend with a bunch of science. <laughs> <laughs> Fine, I'll read this one myself. Nice work, driver. We'll review these and summarize our findings after. Do I have to go up there? The lights are off at some of these stations. I assume I skip those. It's a good thing I have that, uh, I have this thing. The insulated bumper, it seems to be helping me out. Like he was trying to convey something. You can admire the doctor's newfound art skills all you want. You won't find anything useful in them. Okay. Oh, that's water. Uh, you can go around the other side. I guess there's that one in the middle. Is that the this final is one? A decrypted record of the accident. Poppy, are you sure you want to hear this? I, it's got details about Alan's final moments. It's been over 30 years. I'm past ready. Go on, driver. Keep snooping and see what else you can find. Okay. Is this where we started? Looks like it, huh? Um, okay, so there was that one. There. I don't know the best way to get there, though. Let's just uh, go around the inside. Let's see if there's a bridge or something. 
Yeah, the ones that are off look like they don't matter. Oh, I don't... Did I get this one? I think I did. Yeah. Um... Okay, we're good. I think this might be the last one. you know what we found in all this data and make your way back to the auto shop after you're done scouring the place okay Can you drive her thank you okay how the hell do i get out of here now i guess i go back to where i came in from right and go the other way I thought I was gonna have to- I thought it was gonna be like a boss fight where I had to dodge a bunch of fucking buddies or something. I'm not gonna lie, that would've been pretty cool. With like the security system activated and I have to- I had to like... take on something. Oh, this is just the road right here? Okay, perfect. I'm pretty happy with what we found. This is- this is a good one. I just really, really, really need the the hand back and the thermal hand back. Need to build a couple of those. So this takes us back to the garage. Yeah, auto shop. Oh. No. I have to go back to another... Oh. It's a highway. A junction B1 checkpoint. Okay. And then we jump back, I guess. So we get to uh, scout a new spot as well. The Scorch Mid Zone facility. Turn through a gateway. Drive out, you hit the jackpot. We've got a lead on what you're heading toward in the deep zone. Tobias, give us the rundown about the well. Ought to classify it as a hot spot of ultra high energy gamma radiation. Disruptions were spontaneous, and ultimately Autumn made no conclusion about what caused it, when it would blow, or how destructive it would be. Okay. Otter, of course, wanted to control this bottomless well of energy. So they brought in Dr. K and Alan to research activation and containment. They discovered a way to reliably trigger the well, and that was the remnants. And that's what the remnants have been leading people towards. The well. Okay. That's going to be interesting to see. Now, where are these anchors? This second report's a good one. Ready to hear where the remnants came from? The original remnants were created in Dr. K's lab. They aimed to create a trigger for activating the well. By infusing objects with a carefully calibrated limb wave, the ones that shared a resonant frequency would... Yeah, yeah, just get to the good stuff. You know, you'd be a much better ghost hunter if it weren't for that unfortunate attention span. Ha. Reading this makes it obvious how the remnants ended up in the wild. Wait, wait, what, what, what? How? The gamma ray surge that caused the mass hallucination event. That energy irradiated everything within a 10-mile radius. Our 
objects with the right characteristics absorbed that energy and became the remnants people found out in the zone. Wow. Okay, so that's what happened Francis to Carl. Kick out of that one. <laughs> oh. uh, I'll tell him later. His injuries were real. Dr. K's radiation exposure should have been fatal. And the minute he could stand on his feet again, ought to shuttled him right back to his lab and bid the monkey to dance. They allowed him to carry on in the hopes that he would reproduce anything useful. He worked for two whole years before they quietly retired him from his post. I'm sorry we scrambled your brain. Here's your pension. Bye. Oh, okay. There's a lot of info to take in. You got that accident record ready, Tobias? It's time. Okay, then. September 14, 1961. Otter's finalized report on what happened that night. Dr. K and Alan were testing the activation potential of lab-created remnants. That night was a run-of-the-mill remnant test. Nothing out of the ordinary. The remnant in question was a tungsten cube. At okay. 23 a.m., the cube was brought towards the well. The well reacted at nominal levels. However, after 500 meter distance, the cube was sucked into the well and triggered the gamma ray surge. The energy output continued ramping up, and at 15 seconds, showed no signs of stopping. Then, a Alan... Go on. I can handle it. Dr. K testified that Alan engaged the suppression protocol and the kill switch, both of which failed. Oh. Dr. K ordered Alan to get to safety, but Alan, Alan insisted on staying at the controls. Only when he flipped the radiation polarity did the energy output plateau and collapse back into itself. Alan's gamma radiation exposure was fatal due to his proximity to the well. He saved it. The entire zone might have gone under. That's who Alan was. Loyal until the very end. I'm Just like sorry, Carl. Baby. I'd expect nothing less from him. All right, buddy. I can't turn on the windshield wipers. Once that car gets to the well, we can expect another gamma ray eruption. We'll need a way to cut it off. I may have found the answer in Alan's lab notes. His work on that suppression technique is... was top-notch. What's interesting is Dr. K and Alan didn't know any more than we do now. They had no conclusions about what the well is. Or what the remnants did. Or how they interacted with this well. Maybe they're ladles that scoop <gasps> out a metered amount of gamma radiation. Maybe they Bear trigger station. an eruption that we can't stop and will destroy the zone if we get it too close. That's a hell of a rage. What are we going to do? We keep what? going. Uh, but if it's an eruption... I already sacrificed the Olympic Peninsula once for good tech. How many chances for total and utter fallout does a gal get in her life, huh? <laughs> in another life, we would have made a fantastic team. In no universe would I not have murdered you in your sleep. <laughs> this fucking guy! How do I get rid of you? That's one way to do it. <laughs> okay. I wanted to repair myself, but it kept... Okay. Do I need to activate it? That's it? That's all I get? Did it even repair, like... 
I don't know. Didn't seem like it repaired much. Okay. Uh, we're almost at the thing. That didn't look like it had armor plating. Where is it? We got some more of these, at least. Okay. Now, where is that final anchor? It could be down below. Ooh, wow, there's the thing where I can, that I can, uh, there's going to be a workbench, I think. Where is this anchor? Oh, there it is. It's, it's uh, behind me. Did I go past it? Or... Oh, yeah, okay, I guess that makes sense. Whoops. Okay, so one thing I could do to repair the front is remove it and put it in that thing. That's, that's actually probably what I should have done. For this run. Oops. Hurry, buddy. No. Oh, we're going to be able to get so many upgrades. that repair station okay we're good oh, I've got to activate this eh? let's go oh god oh god gateways online and ready to receive get there while you're still breathing this way just wanted to get a direction Like I just noticed I'm only 63% health. I don't want to die. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. At least I healed. Now, of course, shit. Well, acid is hitting the, <laughs> the windshield. <laughs> Tires are holding up nicely. All right, look at all this energy I got. We got unstable, we got stable. Uh, I don't think we got any of the other one. And we're good. Oh, what a run. What a run. Corrupted, I got, oh, I have a little bit of corrupted. Now we go into the deep zone, easy peasy. Except for the issue of the old wall. Right, yeah, that. Uh, you got some genius idea up your sleeve, huh? Is that how you think it works? That scientists conjure up genius at will? Well, yeah, do you? Oh, well, in this case, I do. <laughs> but don't expect it to work like that every time. Driver. The quarantine checkpoints will be the best way through the old wall, but they're death traps in their own right. But I designed something to help. Check out the blueprints I sent over. Death traps. Deep zone crossing. Prepare for the crossing. Okay. Death traps are where I live. Pick up blueprint from Oppie's Numatube. Oh. Lim Shield. The old anomalies took up 
residents in the crossing points. It's not enough to have a shield. The shield itself needs to be shielded. The energy drain on that shield is massive. It won't last you more than five seconds. Francis. Yes, and? You'll need to recharge on the go, but the Deep Zone's grid is completely dark. You know, what if we could reroute our power into the Deep Zone? But we need to jumpstart the network somehow. That car is basically the world's most overpowered electromagnet on wheels. The driver induces a current, then you open the electrical floodgates. And they'd have to induce the current the entire way through the old wall while making the crossing and maintaining speed. I don't know what to tell you. If you don't believe the driver and that car's got what it takes by now, then go back to hunting ghosts. We've got a job to do here. This could work. Are you in, Francis? I, I don't know. Look, we have a real chance of losing everything at the old wall. I'd like to not fail this far along. How can we know this will work? We don't. That's how science works. We form a theory, and we test it, and we fail. And fail, and fail, and only sometimes do we succeed. Come on, Francis. Please? Fine. I'll do it. <laughs> All right. The team is assembled. Driver, get on with building that limp shield. We'll work on spinning up the power grid in the meantime. I like that you asked me for my input. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna get the car ready to rock. I lost the door. Shit! It fell off, didn't it, before I teleported. Alright, we'll get the car fixed up and uh, craft this limb shield and uh, head on out. It feels like we're getting pretty close to the end. Let's finish off getting prepared for the next run as we're uh, gonna be crossing into the deep zone. We have to craft a limb shield. Uh, what do we need for that? I assume, I assume we craft that here. Scrap metal, plasma, circuit board, and thermosap crystals. We caught a bunch of crystals. Sure, the battery cost for this protective device is significant, but in retrospect, it was so obvious that the projection and the suspension of semi-magnetized plasma ions. Okay. In a rapidly oscillating spiner, spiner? Field would provide a substantial physical safeguard. Like, duh. Some of those words make sense to me. Wow, the circuit boards are pretty rare. I think that's, oh yeah, I could, I could build them. That's why. Um, so where do they, where does it go? Oh. It goes on the front or on the back, I guess. So let's uh, let's swap out the bumper since it's busted anyways. Oh yeah, and apparently it said on this that it just cannot be repaired at all. Yeah. Wait. Didn't it just say fix repair putty? Oh, maybe, huh. I don't know. We could throw this into the repair thing though, see. See if it can get repaired. Insulated bumper. Did I swap that for, out for something else? I don't know. Grab this. Can I just... Okay, hold on. That was so, I don't know, weird. Oh my God. Oh, incubator cannot repair. That's what the issue was. All right. Fine, we'll just destroy it. Wait, I didn't get anything from it? <laughs> I guess because it was so destroyed. Uh, right, so we lost this door. It says store items for your drive in the car truck. Wait, 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 did I not make the limb shield? Store items for your to drive in the car truck. Limb shield. Uh, 
I'm a little confused. I must have forgotten something from last time. Uh, missions. Oh, do I have to store another limb shield in in the trunk? I guess is that what they're saying? Okay. Because we need two of them or something. Ah, all right, all right, all right, all right. Nice work on that limb shield driver. We'll have the power grid prepped by the time you reach the old wall. So it says, assign the limb shield car ability to ensure a safe crossing. Reach the first crossing point. I didn't mean to do that. Powerful protective physical shield. Wonderful. Now, let's, uh... Let's get to crafting new stuff. Um, well, actually, I should probably. I should I should do the research first. Then eh? could probably pretty much research anything. Ooh, junction bypass. That's pretty cool. Keep you on the most direct route, allowing you to bypass junctions along highways. Okay. Okay. Wait, before I do anything, can I build that frickin' engine yet? Uh... Oh, I only have 17 thermosat crystals, I guess, after doing the limb thing. Damn it! Okay. Uh, I do want that roof rack. Nitro boost, though. Oh, seat rack. Steel sheet. I need a bunch of steel sheets. Okay. That way I can use the resource scanner. Resource radar, sorry. I really know how that's gonna work. Oh, to detect nearby resources and raw materials. I assume that'll show up on the map. Let's see. Expanded locker, maybe? Another six steel sheets. Okay. I don't know, is that important? Not not really. Advanced workbench, expanded matter regenerator. Expanded capacity, allowing this regenerator to repair more parts simultaneously, and then repair station. Oops. Corrupted energy. I don't have enough corrupted energy for that. The blowtorch. Need a little bit of unstable energy for that. Basic repairs on the road. Maybe. Reinforced headlight seems like a good idea. I have to scan a tour bus anomaly? Shoot. Oh, we got the insulated one. Oh, there's the bio headlight. 
Light projects a powerful, intensely focused beam. It's probably best not to think about whether it might be alive. The side floodlights. I see how that could be useful. It's just not, to me, it's not the most important thing. The armored door. Should I get all the armored stuff now? Shaggy Scrambler. Shit. I already have good bumpers anyways. Okay. The all-terrain tire, right? Paddle tire, puncture proof tire. Let's do all terrain. This is like my favorite part of the game. I, I love the I love doing getting the upgrades. Car storage. Oh. Yeah, trunk in the trunk, maybe. I need that back seat storage, don't I? Side battery hydro generator. That's cool. Mini turbine. Oh, mobile workbench. Oh, I have enough. Oh, but I need Olympium and all that stuff. Okay, we'll get that in the next area, I guess. Hydro boost. Mm, that's tempting. That's one of the abilities, eh? Yeah, maybe. Okay. Oh, s scrambling it, okay. Investigator module. Anchor energy to scan the car for abnormalities. I th think... I might expand the locker. But maybe I should be spending... My resources on. I have a bunch of scrap metal. I'll be fine. I like how I keep jumping over that. I don't know why, but. Oh my god, I need six. Here we go. Guess there's a few places I could have installed that, eh? Probably could have installed it over there, too. Sweet! Also, let's do this. Maybe I should get the better, like, the better scrapper. Yeah. 
plasma scrapper? Yeah. Blowtorch. I should probably get this now, the uh, side floodlights. I probably should have gotten this. Oh well. Need more fabric for that. Interesting. Chemistry and advanced filtration. This battery powered device effectively creates gasoline from various environmental substances. Hassley absorbs in the zone. Be sure to siphon it regularly. Ah, oh, cool. Mini turbines. Using a large propeller to capture wind energy, a kind of janky concept. I would need to apply that to something though. I'd have to I'd have to attach that to the side, right? Lazarus device. Brings you back, I guess. Okay, um... Debris floodlights. Let's try the uh, Liberator. Arc 2. I don't know if I'll be able to make it, but... I'll just, honestly, I'll just save the rest. Okay. So the durability is way higher. And 38 piercing damage per second. Okay. So we can go ahead and get rid of these ones now. Oh shit, the other, the vac. I forgot about the... Thermal vac! Yes. Take a couple of those. Is that replace the hand vac? Like, is it the same thing? It's really more powerful iteration of the hand vac. Okay. Good. Also takes takes up more space. So let's put let's put the tools up here now. Hand back just as a backup to you. This pry bar is almost done. Okay, okay, okay. A bunch of hand bags. We got a couple of these plasma scrappers. I don't think I need another anchor radar.
Oh, it actually replaced the 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 weaker ones with the stronger versions in the uh, shortcut keys. That's nice. Can't build the liberators. What do they require? Explosives. Okay. Here goes my thermo sap, though. But I can make lead-plated panels. I think we're done with steel now. That incubation cannot repair. Oh, okay. I don't. I don't need these. Can I transfer these to the thing? Yeah. Sorry, dumpster. That's cool. I didn't realize I could do that. That's handy. Uh, the other thing I have are these crystals. And I think I just destroy them for stuff. Canned food. MREs. Okay. Page again. That's what he's saying. Mural? Oh, that's cool. Wonder how that's going to look. This will be my healing. spot honestly I should just get rid of these those crowbars aren't really important anymore all bus say they're just taking up space that was fine Should I? I really don't want to have to carry all this stuff, but it's useful to have them in my inventory. Not have to keep swapping, but I can't, I could just, I can't carry as much. I need a bigger backpack again. But I need swamp, coral, and fabric. Yeah, someone was saying get a lot of fat, you're going to need a lot of fabric. Anti static gloves. Protect your hands from electrical discharge with these thick, mighty gauntlets. Yeah. That, might as well get that. Okay. Stick with lead plated. Let's 
sweet armor plated. Armor plate, it's good. Blood plate, it's good. Off road tires, good. Steel, not good. This is steel door, not good. Limb pulsing better, good. Steel panel, not good. Just some storage things. So what are we left with here? One, two, three, I think four panels? Three panels. Three panels and two doors. I drop that other one on the ground. Now we're talking. What the hell? That's gonna kill somebody. Probably me. <laughs> uh, it was three panels, right? Sweet. Just gotta, just gotta get the paint job on these. Probably want like a mix though, eh? Like some of them are resistant to, I don't know. Got different resistances. I want to try this, uh... I don't think the mural's gonna show up very well on these, though. Yeah. Let's stick with the red paint. Is that a space invader up there? Should I grab the other one too? Oops. I thought maybe that was the dark red. What color are you guys painting your Carl's? <laughs> Just assume your car's name is also Carl. Camo's tempting. I think I'm going to stick with the racing stripes, though. That it? Do I just have the one? You can't honestly can't really oh, I've got this one too. You can't really see the racing stripes. Oops. It's all that crap. You know, we know it's there. It makes Carl faster. OK, 
Okay, let's use the vacuum to just get everything cleaned up. I feel like I'm... Okay, maybe I should make some more med kits. Although we have the auto dock thing, eh, right? So... Maybe some more battery jumpers. Some repair putty. Oh, I don't need to carry this. Am I ready to rock, guys? There's uh, this side fuel tank also. I might have too much fuel. Like. Maybe this is a little extreme. Like, why am I so paranoid about fuel? I probably don't need all this storage anymore. I should build something else to go on the side. I'm just used to it now. Okay, charge it up. Which the first crossing point. Oh, right, hold on. Got all these two. Might as well get rid of them. Okay. I kind of like I'm tempted to do the light blue. Maybe next run. Oh, right. There's just the quirks. So. Six. Is there actually six quirks right now? <laughs> Honestly, it doesn't bother me. It's kind of funny. Yeah. Quirk. Oh, the lights. Yeah, I forgot about the, the one crude headlight. Okay. And we have one insulated headlight. Side fun lights. Okay, let's go with that. Um, so do I put these, like, onto the side storage, I guess? Um, I'll deal with that later. Uh, I'm fine. This stuff's... We're, we're fine. We're fine. Let's go. I want to play, I wanna play the game. Oh, so we're going over here. Okay. So I guess we go this way, G1, and then here, then here. First crossing point. Here we go. I always feel like I'm forgetting something. Oh, for crying out loud. I'll fix that, <laughs> fix that other headlight. Definitely getting a lot smoother with playing the game. I 
I kind of like that Carl has quirks, to be honest with you. It makes the game more entertaining. Oh shit, was that? All right, the engine was on. I have so much fuel, I don't think that'll be a problem. Famous last words. Okay, let's win the game. I'm sure, I'm sure there's a lot more to do. I'm sure I'm not winning the game now. We got to get into the middle first.